talk about the Springfield model of 1884. And you may say, Garrett, why that looks just like a Springfield model of 1873. And it does, but there are a few minor differences. Non-high arch in it, a wider breech block, and when you close it, you can see a gap right there. That is for gas to escape if you have a case head separation. Also, you will notice we have a different rear sight than the 1873. This is known as the Buffington rear sight. And this is basically a computer of a rear sight for the 1800s or the 19th century. Uh, you have up and down adjustment, you have left and right windage adjustment. Other than that and the cleaning rod, this is pretty well the same as the 1873, except for it's sighted in to use the heavier 500 grain bullet that has a solid base. Very, very good bullet. This would be the rifle that would carry us through the way into the Spanish-American War.